7 Action News at 7 starts right now. A little girl holding a special place in a big family. How their dreams are turning into a reality this holiday season. And did you know this is National Adoption Month? Families all over the country are getting a little big. 7 Action News reporter Anne-Marie LaFlame has one Washington Township family story of opening their hearts to foster care. There are hundreds of children in Michigan waiting to be adopted, thousands in foster care. And though Nathan and Bethany Bills already have five children of their own, one little girl found a very special place in their hearts. I'm Kendall. I'm Fallon. I'm Hayden. I'm Gracie. I'm Hadley. And then there was Sanaya. Anyone who meets her is in love with her. It's really cool how your heart can hold so much and you can be open to loving, you know, so many. I mean, it was the first time we looked at her. I mean, we just felt it. That was when she was just 13 days old. Now at 14 months, Nathan and Bethany Bills are the only parents Sanaya has ever known. Everything that we were able to say yes has prepared us for um, in our hearts and our lives to be able to be at the point where we're at with Sanaya. Their first yes to becoming foster parents. The Bills and their five children began fostering three years ago and have welcomed nearly a dozen children into their homes. And just a few short months after fostering Sanaya, her mother's rights were terminated. And there's just like a certain place in your heart that you begin to experience this new kind of love that it's, it's just as deep as, you know, the love that we have for our own children. It was an easy decision for this family of seven. They all agreed they were meant to be a family of eight. But there was still a long process ahead. Fast forward one year. We are asked probably a couple you know, just a couple times a day. Is it is it final yet? Is it done? Is, is she all yours? And soon she will be. And uh, we just can't wait for that day to celebrate that. This Thanksgiving, Sanaya officially becomes a Bills. I think it's going to feel really good when we get that birth certificate in our hand <laughs> with our uh, with our last name on it. So um, she's had a shirt for a few months that I can't wait to put on her that says officially a Bills. It's amazing to to just know that um, we get to spend every day just loving her. A feeling shared by families all over the country as their adoptions are finalized this month and a feeling every child still in foster care dreams of every day. If it's not gonna be us, then who's it gonna be? And if it's not now, I mean, how long are we gonna wait to actually do something about the need? And the Bills say they're open to fostering and adopting even more children. And if you're thinking of fostering or adopting a child in the Michigan foster system or even becoming a mentor, we can get you in touch with the right people. I've put all that contact information on our website. That's WXYZ.com. I'm Ian Marie LaFlame, 7 Action News. You know, that's such a beautiful story because so many kids, you know, end up in foster care yeah. for so many years and never get a forever family. But, you know, you need a family like that to open up their hearts open and open there. up their Home. And you came from a large family, so you know there's always room. Yeah, there is. There's always room for one more. For sure, for sure. After five, you know. Yeah, I'll be, be, be careful. At that point, <laughs> just keep adding. There you go.